am here in Newark, New Jersey, Cooper's Deli. One of the uh, one of the best delis around, from what I've been told. Y'all know me. I love sandwiches. I love pastrami. All right, don't don't mind my uh, don't mind my attire today. I'm playing golf right after this, so and I'm gonna get some pastrami. I'm gonna get uh, however the lo locals get it, and uh, this is a liquor store too. So you come here, get your fix, and get your drink. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. Mr. Kuvas opened this store up in 67. 67. Mm -hmm. It's like a staple community there. Pardon? It's like well, absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Cooper's Deli, Mr. Cooper. I wish I could have met y'all. Well, I wish I wish I could have met you, but I love what's going on here. This is a an institution here in the Newark community. Everything looks just as good as New York. Like Cat's Deli, or even like Reading Terminal Market, like Herschel's. Like they are just as good. And don't let the fact that it's right here for you. These guys are actually putting in work. You see the quality in the meats, the pastrami, the corned beef. And these guys got it going on. So I'm truly excited. Cooper's Deli, make sure you come visit the small mom and pop shop. I said, I used to be scared of them. I used to be scared of this place because they give you so much meat, man. But now I frequent it. It's like 20 years later, man. Yo. So how long you been going here? Since high school, man. High school. The 80s, man. Yo. So this is a, a Newark uh, institution right here. Yeah, that's true, man. Just like you said, man. Yes, sir. I can't wait to try this out. Yep. You hit you on the head, man. Yes, sir. Thank you, man, for what you do. Please, man. All right, just so y'all know, there, there's actually, normally I like to post up and eat right in front of the shop but I, I got the minivan today and the hood on the minivan isn't all that big so uh and i have a tea time yes i play golf that's how i get my i get my weight down because of golf but um i'm gonna take this somewhere else to eat it and uh let's see how it is it looks it looks amazing it looks like your legendary deli that you go to in, in new york and philadelphia so follow me we're gonna Head over to somewhere, may I can find a table here down oh, somewhere and eat, eat the food, all right? All right, so uh, we drove like five minutes down a road. It's called Cherry Blossom. Cherry Blossom, Cherry Blossom. there's picnic seating here. And uh, let's let's get into some uh, to some eating. I got the homie Hella Chuli with me. Someone was like, why did you call him Hella Chuli? You guys, you guys don't know our lingo. All right, let's do this. So pastrami, mustard, Pastrami, rye, mustard, lettuce, tomato, and cheese. I think that's you. Oh, they got the pickle on top. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Oh, man, just take a bite. Go ahead. Let people know. We're gonna get right into it. Starving too. Starving. Mm hmm Fire. It's the one. It's the one. Pastrami is juicy, tender, and flavorful, and one of my favorite deli cuts. Good, nice and loose. Let me see again. Perfect. All right. I got two sandwiches. I got the pastrami as well, and I got the brisket because the homie said, you want to try the brisket? I said, what you talking about? Let's do it. <laughs> this is a really nice park. Yeah, Cherry Blossom. Cherry Blossom Park. Pastrami, double wrapped. We got the pickle right on top on the outside wrapper. Whew, gosh, this, this looks... The reveal on this one is even crazier. Mmm. I think this is yours. <laughs> this got cheese and lettuce, tomatoes on there. Yeah, let's do half and half. Oh my gosh. That looks amazing. That looks amazing. I got a pickle. I think I did. Oh, did you already eat your pickle? No, I ate mine. Oh, yeah, let me get that, dog. Look at it. Nice, nice colors to it. Do you see it? This is about as good as it gets. I mean, everyone hypes up Cats. Cats is good. I ain't go front. Cats is really good. Herschel's is really good. But this, to me, this is so unassuming. Like, if, if I wasn't, I mean, I'm not from the area, but if you drive past by it, you'll see a liquor store right on the corner. And who knew that they had a top-notch deli, top-notch pastrami, corned beef, brisket, and you get yourself, uh, you know, some Henny. Sorry for the lighting. 
This is the pastrami, lettuce, tomato, cheese, and mustard. Cheers. Seven, bring it back. <laughs> I don't think I've ever had it with cheese. Well, phenomenal. Phenomenal. Thinly sliced. Mm. This is so fresh. Shout out to Mr. Cooper, the whole team. Y'all see? I do my research and it seemed like everyone is saying that Mr. Cooper or Cooper's Deli used to give you more meat than this. This is a good healthy serving. They weigh every every time they slice it. Banging. It's like it has like a, a nice amount of fat. Yeah. I like that fat on the pastrami, man. That's so good. Really nice amount of fat. This is just a regular one. Um, we got three sandwiches, two drinks, like about 35? 40 bucks maybe? 40 bucks. That's, that's really good. That's actually really good pricing compared to like other places. It's so juicy. Maybe because it has like the fat. Nice amount of fat. Hmm. That's so good. Someone told me to get the pastrami with the Russian dressing. I didn't get it. I got whatever the uh, the gentleman in the front recommended. That's how I normally do it. So to me, excellent. Shout out to Cooper. Shout out to Newark, Brick City in the house. You already know. I've been wanting to come to this place for a long time. I'm here. It was everything. I love highlighting shops like this. You know, this, this is what this channel is all about. And I'm honestly, I'm truly gonna finish this off camera. So I was about to be out the door. The guy said, "Hey, you want to try our brisket sandwich?" I'm like, "That sounds. Let's do it. Don't threaten me with good food." <laughs> this is on a hero. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna say hero because I'm up north. Comes with a pickle. Want an extra pickle? You can have it. Don't threaten me with a good pickle. <laughs> <laughs> Don't threaten you with a big, a good pickle. But this is on a hero. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna say hero because I'm up north. Comes with a pickle. Want an extra pickle? You can have it. Don't threaten me with a good pickle. <laughs> Don't threaten you with a big, a good pickle. So this is the brisket with the gravy. So we got the gravy on here. This is super juicy. Super juicy. Here, bro. This this bread is is uh this bread is super soft, lightweight. Mm. Mm. Ultra tender. Ultra tender. I mean crazy the touch on the gravy hold on it's getting windy I like the touch on the gravy and all that a really good sandwich not bad um when I eat something like this I kind of like need like a, a, a 
I should have asked for mustard or horseradish or something, you know? I feel like this this is what needs it. Like to make the meat, the bread is really soft. Well, I took a bite. It's so tender, it looks like ground beef. It just needs like onions and like long hots in here. It's so simple right now. It's, it tastes really good, but it's, this one needs toppings. This one needs well, some some sweet peppers, some long hot, some some roasted peppers, some onions and mustard. But the the, the, the brisket itself is is ultra tender. Hmm. Very good, man. Yo, shout out to Cooper's Deli, Newark, New Jersey. That's what we got. If you're in the area, North Jersey, you want to support this small mom and pop shop, well, definitely. They've been in business since like 1960 something. Everyone's so personal. They're nice. You can get you something to drink after you load yourself up with some good pastrami, corned beef, or whatever it is you want to order. Good spot. So that's it. Thank y'all for the recommendation. Shout out to the homie Hella Chuli. I'm about to show him how to play golf for the first time ever in life. Oh, yeah. Um, so yeah, that's all we got. Subscribe. See you on the next one. Peace.